Shooting documentaries and stock footage is something I do full time. That's all I do. I tell stories and I always want to tell true stories and capture the beauty of nature. From childhood, I used to watch documentaries and I get excited. Things that other people will watch and they wouldn't even want to pay attention to. I love them. Like the National Geographic stuff. The things that really didn't entertain. Halfway in my technical education program, I used to do graphic designing and some basic photo editing on computers. That was when I developed the love for filmmaking. With filmmaking, I don't have any formal education. I'm a self-taught person and maybe friends. This profession helps me to express myself and also affect society positively. I came across Shutterstock a year and a half ago. Shutterstock has helped me in so many ways because the fact that some of my footages have been bought and been shown on international televisions tells me that I'm growing as a filmmaker. With my kind of films that I make, you don't have a budget. They are not films that are mainstream films that goes on the market and get bought. They are more or less like social-minded stuff. I travel a long way out of town to shoot on my own risk, no insurance, traveling on rivers, traveling at dangerous places and all that. I quite remember in the middle of one of my journeys, uh, the boat I was traveling with capsized and I lost everything. What pushes me to do art is something that's very difficult for me to express it with words. I just love to do art. I just love to create. I just love to solve problems with the little creative ability that I have. The fact that I'm able to tell stories of others who don't have the platform that I have makes me so fulfilled and happy. I have a, a film that I'm working on that I'm so passionate about. It's about a village in the western part of Ghana. The whole village is built with bamboo and raffia and the village is situated in the middle of the river. The reason for making this film is that I want to tell the story of how the village came to be. And on the other hand too, I want to tell the world how the people have been able to survive on that river. When I'm granted this fund, I'll make sure I finish my film and also replace some of the equipment that I've already lost. Winning the Shutterstock Art Grant will mean so much to me in a sense that I'll have more time to be able to do the things that I love get more equipment, do more, and get more creative, and fulfill my passion. Apart from being a filmmaker, I don't really know what I would have been doing now. Maybe probably I would have been on a construction site using chisel and hammer and saw and cutlasses and all that. My name is Osei Ousubanahine. I'm Ghanaian. And I'm Shatterstock. Oh, I love.